of those uh, two buildings that is Billing Creek. That's where Discovery was. First of Discovery is still connected to the International Space Station on the space. As we get by operations support building number one here on the line, uh, you're going to get a view, uh, great view of the orbiter processing facility, the south side. Now, just to give you a little sense of scale, the flag on the vehicle assembly building is the tallest painted flag in the world, 290 feet tall, 110 feet across. Each one of the stars, six feet across. Each one of the stripes, eight and a half feet across. And the blue field is the size of an NBA basketball court. Now, the NBA was completed in 1966, 525 feet tall. And it takes up eight and a quarter acres of land. Eight and a quarter acres. Now, uh, sticking out from the main body of the vehicle assembly building is the launch control center. It's uh, that building over there with an outside stairwell. That's where the countdown takes place. That's where all four redundant firing rooms are. That is the computer brain of every launch that we've had from that 39 AMP. And that's going back even as far as the Apollo program. Now, look at the roof. See a railing or a fence going all the way around the top of that building. That's where the immediate families of the astronauts view a shuttle launch from. Away from the press site now, away from any public viewing areas now. Our uh, press site is over there on the right hand side. Now look, keep looking to the right, you'll see a flagpole and it's uh, a little closer to go right up next to it. Six million pounds of machinery. They have top the uh, platform is the size of a baseball diamond. Each one of those uh, cleats on, that, uh, on those tracks weighs a, a ton of piece. There's 57 cleats on each uh, track. Now the crawler has the ability to lift that entire platform another six feet in the air and do that hydraulically. Advanced to lift our mobile launch platform and completed shuttle stack off of pedestals in the VAP. Then we transport that mobile launch platform and completed shuttle stack down to identical pedestals at the pad. And then the crawler is going to come up. Uh, for this uh, staging area. This is a four-story observation again. Make sure you get all your belongings with you as you exit the bus. Remember, you're going to be taking a different bus to continue on with your tour. Your first point of attention is going to be this briefing theater right in front of us. There's also wheelchairs here if anybody gets tired. And there's elevators to take you to the top of the observation theater. Again, make sure you get